What's up, what's up, ladies and gentlemen? This is the Prince of YouTube PS Compulsion signing in here, aka that 22 year old kid with the light squeaky voice, aka Prince Anthony. And I am finally getting ready to play my first game in the NBA. But check this out I got to show you guys my stats first. Basically, I'm still trash. I only have a 62 overall, so I'm pretty sure that I'm not going to play too well this game, especially because it's my first game, so I'm more than likely going to get like two minutes or something. I don't even know. Before the game, I decided to invite Kyrie Irving and Gordon Haywood over to my court so we all could hang out and we all could chat and I could get some advice from Kyrie himself on what to expect in my first game in the NBA. I'm not relying on Shammy. Why the hell do they have this dude following me around bothering the the shit out of me i have no idea this is like last year's justice this dude is super freaking annoying he basically told me before the game that i'm not gonna get no minutes no playing time nobody wants to see me ball out but that's exactly what i'm gonna do i'm gonna ball out so before the game i'm here at shoot around and i was missing a whole bunch of wide open shots so i just started taking it to the basket and doing layups because that's basically all i could do layups taking it to the basket that's what i'm trying to do anyways bro that's what i'm trying to do anyways but anyways here we are in cleveland getting ready for our first game of the season Kyrie Irving's first game against Cleveland, Isaiah Thomas' first game against the Boston Celtics. Oh, man, I gotta help my man Kyrie Irving destroy the Cavs, and I'm hoping that I get some minutes to play with Kyrie this game because they probably gonna put me with the bench unit. They normally do that for the first game, but check this out. Me and Kyrie got a signature handshake right before the game. My son gave me a hug. Come on, bro. That's like my best friend right now, but nonetheless, here we are getting ready for tip-off time here in Cleveland. LeBron, IT, Tristan Thompson and those guys against Kyrie Irving, Prince Anthony, Gordon Haywood, Cavs, Celtics, up next, Kyrie's return to Cleveland. I was going to try the 2K camera for this first game, but nah, I had to change it. Anyways, just subbed into my first NBA game, and look at this. I'm giving up a wide open three. J.R. Smith can't knock it down, though. Here I am. First possession for me in the NBA. Let's see what I got. Here's Rozier. He gets it to me. I can't shoot, so I'm just passing, bruh. Let's see what I got. Ah, damn. Ah, nah. I was going to pop a jump shot, but I'm not going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to run that sexy pick and roll. Shot clock winding down. I am not going nowhere. I get it to Tatum. Tatum launches a three-pointer and knocks it down. My team is doing good without me. Like, as soon as I subbed into the game, we already had a double-digit lead. <laughs> Oh, uh, man. Let's see what we got on this possession. I'm in there with Terry Rozier. He passes it to me. I passes it right back. Terry Rozier for three. And this Cleveland crowd is silent as hell. Like, look at this lead. Sexy lead for my first game in the NBA. But I forgot that Rose and Crowder is on the Cleveland Cavaliers, especially Rose. I totally forgot that he signed with the Cleveland Cavaliers. But look at that. Playing that sexy defense on Derrick Rose, not letting him get nothing. You want to leave the New York Knicks, you definitely not scoring on me. All right, let's see what I got on this possession. I got to push this lead up. I'm about to try to drive to the basket. Look at that. Nice move on Richard Jefferson. Taking it to the basket and one. Look at that Anthony. sexy and one in my first game in the NBA. Look at that spinning on Jefferson. What you thought you was doing, bro? Come on. That's too easy. We playing so well right now that I feel so bad for the Cavs. Let me see if I can make this free throw, though. Come on. Don't miss that. There we go. They're giving me a pretty good amount of minutes here in the second quarter so far. So I'm guessing I'm probably not going to get much minutes for the rest of the game. Maybe. I don't even know. I just really want to play with my man Kyrie Irving right now. But, hey, playing with Rozier and Tatum would suffice for now. <laughs> All right. Let's see what I got on this possession. I'm not going nowhere, so I'm going to just give it back to Rozier. Trying to set that screen for him. Rozier taking it to the basket. Oh, look at that. Morris wide open three. He misses, but I get the tip in. Okay. I didn't play in the third. They gave me like two minutes or one minute, I should say, in the fourth quarter. Probably like two possessions in the fourth quarter. And, yeah, this is pretty much my NBA debut. End of the fourth quarter. Game coming to a close. I'm going to go ahead and put up one more shot, and I knock it down. Let's go. <laughs> I had to get my points. Come on, bro. I had to launch that, but my NBA debut is a success. We blow out the Cleveland Cavaliers. I had a pretty decent game for like five minutes of playing time. I had seven points, two assists, two rebounds, no steals, but I got a teammate grade of B+. That's pretty sexy right there. For my first game in the NBA, my NBA debut success bro and looking at all the points that i earned for my badges i earned a good amount of points the main badge i'm trying to rank up right now is the relentless finisher i gotta be able to get to the basket i say that like a million times but nonetheless my nba debut was a success i helped Kyrie irvin 
and Gordon Haywood destroyed the Cleveland Cavaliers. Oh man, good NBA debut for me. Are you here for me? We are, let's go. Okay. I, I mean, I know I had a decent game, but uh, man, hold, does she ever slow down? Nope. Well, I thought we were gonna be in the, in we the press conference. We got a solo conference. hit on you. Special request. Fresh meat? No way. Was Shaq and Kenny? NBA TV? Moochie the Mad Cow, WPON. Sports Radio, 56. Wait, Moochie the, the Bond. What? You're doing a remote interview. Put these on. Uh, hello? How you doing, DJ? Nice game. Thanks for taking a couple of minutes. No problem, Moochie. Great. Let's get started. Sports Radio 56 with Moochie. All right, all right, Moochie the Mad Cow here with new rookie, DJ. DJ just put in work in his first ever NBA game. DJ, you played great tonight. How did it feel out there? It felt incredible, man. I mean, and honestly, it's all credit to my teammates. I mean, they just, they believed in me. They kept feeding me the ball. They saw that I felt great. And coach, coach just, he let me take shots that, you know, maybe he shouldn't have, but it all worked out tonight. Love the attitude. A real team player. You kind of came out of nowhere to make the league. How are you adjusting to the speed of the game? It's been pretty easy. I mean, the coaches on this team are incredible, man. They just do the best job that they can to keep us prepped. Uh, you know, the vets on this team are great. And, you know, whenever I have a question about, like, plays or, or coverage or, you know, anything, really, I mean, they're, they're always there to help me. And they, you know, they just keep reminding me to just keep going hard in the gym and, and, and keep watching tape and going over the, you know, plays and, and everything will fall into place like it did tonight. Spoken like a true veteran. That's all the time we have for today. I'd like to thank DJ for taking a few minutes to talk to us after his NBA debut. Thanks again, DJ. No problem, man. Wow, that's it? That's it. Thanks, DJ. Yeah, that felt good. He was great. Yeah. Maybe he should give Shammy a few pointers. <laughs>